sadness, but denied to a spring for us. The closeness of our existences is so immensely immeasurable. There is no space for time and reality to break our bonds. Our immense openness to each other lets us lie in each other's nakedness without uncertainty. Tonight, we are defined by untouchable intensity. Let our bodies tremble in glorious silence, or let them collide in a sudden finding of me. relatively new work, which I wrote last week in a wash. I hope it's any good. I um, wrote it during our test, so we <laughs> back to you. <laughs> and check me out as you know, wrote this. When the universe revolved around us, or at least my universe, we were a cliche many wanted for themselves. Stolen kisses with backs returned, crossed hands, unseen on their tables. That is all we were to others, yet we were more to ourselves. In those moments, you and I were love itself. We melted into the romances of books and movies and other cliche things. And we reveled in the newness of us. But we are no longer in the bond that held us in eternal nights. We are not once we believed we could be. The last chapter of the book has been read, and the credits have started rolling. Yeah. Okay, any of you guys know Francisco Balagtas slash Baltasar? Yeah. Uh, you know Florida and Laura? Yeah. So we're studying at the school and there's this one chapter, chapter 16 or 17. And we just studied it like last Wednesday. And most of us found it really gay. Because there's a part where the guy was on the tree and he's all tired and staying there, tied to the tree for months. And some other dude comes and saves him and they have this theme. And it was really, really gay. So I decided to write about it. Because it was just, just there in the back of my mind. It was really disturbing me. And this, so it's called Chapter 17, Unedited. He didn't know how he ended up on some stranger's chest. He didn't care. His body was still painted with fresh rope marks. And the stranger was still in his face. The man's hands were rough, but there was unusual gentleness, gentleness in his touch. When he opened his eyes, he felt his whole being succumb to his grasp. It's really hard, but yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you get bored when you're listening to pictures. This is my last word for tonight. It was the first poem I've written in a year, so it's a breakthrough poem for me. Also, really, really, really short. From Across Borders. No demands from you or me because our love isn't spoken. We are content in loving in silence and stillness. As we love without words, we kiss without words. And we kiss with hallways between our lips. Because love, our souls have found each other in silence and secret. Our hearts know what we do not. Thank you. Thank you. Thanks, Trisha. You always, you really steal the, the stage when you, when you perform. Thanks for sharing your poetry. <laughs> I'm sorry to your teachers that you're more productive. In